going on, guys? Kevin here from Sportsbox Breaks coming at you live Friday night, November 23rd, 2018. I'm doing a random for three different cards which have multiple teams on them. Uh, these cards all came up tonight in the um, 2018 Panini Immaculate Football, the six box, case, six box case break number two. It's the second one that went off um, tonight here. So you can see the full break in its entirety from start to finish in a separate video here on our YouTube channel. This is just going to be the random cards right here. So the three cards in question are as follows. Uh, jersey numbers, jersey number 31. It's a 21 of 50. It's the Cardinals against the Browns, David Johnson, Nick Chubb. So we got two different owners on those two teams. Uh, we have this triple relic right here. It's a 3 of 10 triple relic. Zeke Elliott, Saquon Barkley, and Darius Geis. So Cowboys, Giants, Redskins. Two color patch on each piece right there. 3 of 10. And then, well, this beauty right here. I put it in a, uh, a thick penny sleeve for the moment, but I will be putting this in a one-touch magnetic when it ships off to you guys. Saquon Barkley for the Giants. Rashad Penny, Seahawks, Sony Michelle, Patriots, Nick Chubb, Browns. That's a one of one. That's crazy stuff right there. NFL Shield, NFL PA stuff, like crazy stuff. That might be the first one of one I've seen that has four different uh, teams on it. So pretty crazy stuff. Guys, to escape going to the random... Uh, somebody has to own better than two-thirds ownership. So, for instance, two-thirds ownership on this card would be two out of three. But better than two-thirds ownership on a four-player card is, is basically three out of four. So 66% or more if you're just doing the math on it. So no, nobody owned that many spots in these, uh, in these particular cards. So each one will have to be set up in a random. So here is, without further ado, here's random.org. We're going to use the dice to determine how many times we randomize up those lists. And here is the first card represented, jersey numbers, 21 of 50. So you're going to see the Cardinals are in here twice, <clears throat> and the Browns are in here three times. And you might ask, why are these in here multiple times? We do our randoms, and this has been well publicized. We've been doing it for four and a half years, guys. We do them in a weighted fashion. So as many spots as you own in any of our breaks, uh, when and if your card goes to a random setup, you will get that many entries in the random setup for as many teams as you own. So the Cardinals are in here twice because the owner of the Cardinals has the Cardinals plus one other team in the break. The owner of the Browns has the Browns plus two other teams in the break. So you can see the Browns get three entries in the random. Any question on that, guys, refer to our website, How Breaks Work page. Refer to our eBay listings. It's well laid out in the eBay listings. We even have a dedicated section in our Breakers.tv page. Uh, titled How Randoms Are Set Up. So that is the way we've been doing it and the way we'll continue to do it. Uh, the second one is going to be the 3 of 10 triple relics. So the Cowboys in here once, same logic applies. The owner of the Cowboys has only the Cowboys. The Giants are in here once because they only have the Giants spot. And then the Redskins are in here twice because Travis has the Redskins plus one other team. <clears throat> and then here's the one everybody's going to be interested in, the quad relic one of one. The Giants are in here one time because Chris has the Giants. The Seahawks are in here one time. Uh, same logic there. And then the Patriots get one, two, three, four entries because the owner of the Patriots has that team plus three other teams in the break. And the owner of the Browns has the Browns plus two others. So the Browns get three entries. All right, guys, here we go. We're going to roll up the virtual dice X amount of times. Uh, it's going to show us a number. If the number comes up at two, we will random three times. But we're going to use the face value of the dice to go with on those lists otherwise. Here we go. We get a 7 again. We did a 7 earlier. 4 plus 3 equals 7. So we're going 7 times. This is going to be the jersey numbers, 21 of 50. So I'm taking away the header, so we got a clean list. So Cardinals and the Browns, 7 times. There's 1. 2 times. 3. That's 4. That's 5. That is 6. And that is seven. So there it is, guys. The Browns come up in the top slot. And that is going to be the jersey number card, which I'm going to give you a quick glimpse of off to the side there. So the jersey number card is going to be the Browns. Making a note of it off to the side here, fellas, so I can make it easy on myself later. All right, guys. The next card is going to be the three of ten triple relic. So taking this guy away, we're doing it the same number of times, which is seven. Here goes. One time. That's two, three times. That's four, five, six, and seven times. There it is, guys. The Giants come up in the top slot. Chris L., there you go, man, picking up the three of ten relic. The uh, triple relic, three of ten. So the Giants come up in the top slot after the number seven. And again, there's the dice showing the number seven. All right, guys, here we go. The last one, the big boy, the one of one, taking away the header. And we're going seven times on this list. Good luck, good luck. 
That's one time. That's two. Three times. That's four. Five. Six. And here it is, guys. Good luck on the next one. Seven times. Boom. There it is. The Seattle Seahawks, which I think were a pretty big underdog, right? The Seahawks only had one entry. The Seahawks are going to be taking the one of one card. There it is. Seattle comes up in the top slot as of seven times. Seattle Seahawks. So here it is, guys, recapping. Seven times on the one of one card, Seattle. Uh, seven times on the previous card, the Triple Relic, the Giants. Seven times on the first one, the jersey numbers, the Browns. And there's the dice roll showing the number seven. Guys, thanks again for getting it filled. We have more of this product on the website. We'd love to see you in the next one, guys.